Hi guys, Shayna Tony here. And if you're watching this video, maybe you're struggling a little bit to, you know, break through that threshold of success, the, the success that you dream of and that you aspire for, but you just can't break through. Well, today we're going to cover the two foundations of success. Stay with me. I release videos that teach you how to become a successful digital entrepreneur. So consider subscribing. Also, if you like this content, click in the link below to get access to my free four day video value series that teaches you the strategies on how to build a successful digital online business. Now I have a little bit of a lazy eye today. So if you think I'm winking at you, then I probably am. Now here are the two foundations of success. Foundation number one, the right mindset. Foundation number two, the right system. Now most people go right into the right system and completely ignore the right mindset. Did you know that the right mindset determines your success by 80%. That is a huge number. So think about it. Now, how do we get the right mindset? Well, from a very early age, we are all conditioned to think in a certain way. We're conditioned by our parents, our family, our friends, teachers, the school, the school system, the mass media. We're all conditioned to think like employees. You see, I was told, and I'm sure many of you are told, that, you know, go to college and graduate from good college so you can go and get a great job. And like myself, I went, I got that great corporate job. But guess what? I was miserable for so many years. I was miserable. And so, you know, that is so many of us. And let's work on our mindsets. And we're going to talk about that a little bit more so that we can really determine, you know, what is it with our mindset that is holding us back. So let's compare the employee mindset with the entrepreneur mindset. Now, first, time. The employee mindset thinks of time as something to be spent. You know, we spend time at work. And not only that, but when we're not spending time at work, trading time for money, then we are looking forward to free time so that we can spend our free time doing the things that we enjoy. Maybe going to sporting events or spend time uh, shopping or spend time watching TV or going to the movies or, you know, spending our time, right? And let's face it, we all need leisure time and we need to enjoy our life, but, you know, we are spending time and the mindset of spending time is, uh, is, a, is a little bit off when we can look at time in a different way, like the entrepreneurial mindset. The entrepreneurial mindset around time is to, you know, see time as an investment, to see time as value. And, you know, entrepreneurs are really great at time management. So they're able to do all of those leisure things that we talked about, but they also understand that, you know, and that they can use time to make their dreams a reality and they invest time to do that. Now let's talk about money. 
The entrepreneur, the, I'm sorry, the employee mindset around money is the same. We spend money. Money is a tool so that we can spend. And, uh, you know, so many of us are keeping up with the Joneses. We, you know, we see our neighbor has a new car. Oh, we have to get a new car. They have a new boat. We have to get a new boat. Oh, we have to have the latest fashion trends and the latest electronic gadgets. And, you know, guess what? We're spending money and it's okay to spend money and, and have a comfortable life. But when it becomes excessive and spending money on things that are only going to depreciate and have no value in the future, then you're spending money, wasting money, you see? Now, the entrepreneur mindset around money is the same with time. Money is an investment. You see, entrepreneurs understand that instead of working for money, money can work for them because it depends on what you do with the money, but they invest their money to grow their money. You know, a lot of entrepreneurs uh, grow their money in a lot of different ways, whether it be uh, with stocks or cryptocurrency or the real estate market, maybe gold and silver. I mean, there's so many also investing in other businesses. There's so many different ways to grow your money and it's a it's a completely different mindset from the employee over here spending money as long as you're spending money you're never going to grow money okay the next one are dreams now the employee mindset has dreams great fantastic but we make the mistake of saying you know, I want to be successful. I want to uh, have my own business. I want to, you know, whatever your want is. But as long as you're wanting, 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 you know, that means that your dream is out there somewhere, that your dreams are external. And when your dreams are external, how are you going to, uh, how are you ever going to make those dreams come true? They're out there somewhere you know now with the entrepreneurial mindset they understand that their dreams are in here right their dreams are within themselves and they have the power to create their own reality and uh you know that's a that's a very cool thing because when you look at dreams in a different way an entrepreneur says, I will be successful. I am successful. I am wealthy. I am, you know, I am. Because they are. They have the dream, the ambition, the goal inside. It's not out there. I hope that makes sense. Okay, the next one are problems, okay? So the employee mindset views problems as something bad <laughs> and to be avoided at all costs um so they take they take uh, the easy road because they don't want to encounter problems now the entrepreneur mindset around problems are that they actually welcome problems you know entrepreneurs are very good or have become very good at problem solving and they understand when they have a problem then they can utilize the, the problem solving skills that they have and it's only going to make them better at what they're trying to achieve and becoming better at what you're try, trying to achieve, then that means you're going to become successful, okay? The next one are failures. Now, the, the employee mindset around failures is, uh, you know, we never start out doing something that we intend to fail at, okay? We, we, we're, we're doing something that we feel we have a good shot of making happen, but at the first signs of failure, then we start to say, oh, you know, this, this, this is, doesn't work for me, or this just doesn't work, or what have you. And so we, we fail because we don't continue, basically, and, 
we never allow that to happen. And so how are you going to make your, your dreams, your goals, your ambitions come true if you let one failure or two failures hold you back? But a lot of us give up, okay? Now, the entrepreneur mindset is different because the entrepreneur, you know, didn't, they didn't stop at that first failure. And they didn't stop at the second failure. They they failed once, twice, three times, and so on. They've failed so many times. But the reason why they are an entrepreneur and they are successful is because they never give up. They have what we call perseverance. And that that is the difference. You know, it's two completely different mindsets. And you have the power to choose which mindset, you know, you have the power to rewire your thinking. And I hope that uh, that really helps you out. And I hope that you kind of see some differences and you're able to work a little bit more on yourself self to, you know, to push through that threshold and really become that success that you want to be. Um, now, let's talk about the right system. We are using systems in our lives every single day. You know, we've had coaches, teachers, mentors that have helped us to learn different systems and implement different systems in our lives. And we're constantly using them every single day. And, uh, you know, these people are, are fantastic. They're great in our life. They're, you know, we, we, we value them because now we utilize these systems, whether it is, whether you had a coach, you know, teach you to swing a bat at baseball or a teacher teach you piano or to drive a car, whatever it might be. We're using these systems every single day. We use these systems in business also. And I will tell you, I've used systems in my business, many different systems, but not all of them work for me. And not every single mentor work for me either because we all learn in a different way. So when you find the, the, the right system that you can implement that works for you, then wow, you've won. You, now you have the right mindset and you have the right system. Does that make sense? So now we're on that fast track to winning and winning big. So if you're looking for the right system, I encourage you uh, to, to maybe, you know, let me try and help you. And I would love for you to be part of my system. And if you'd like to, you can just click on the link below and get access to my free four day video value series. And I'll take you through my system and hopefully help you achieve your goals and your dreams of having an online business or becoming an entrepreneur. And you know, I will see you on the inside. Thanks for watching.